I think I'm with Afro today. Mr. Fro? Is that yeah, you? What up? Wow, I can't believe C9 is picking Thresh. This is like a so low win percentage playoffs type pick. Mm -hmm. But maybe um, they, they see two tanks and they think, okay, you know, it's a good game for perma hooking. My, you have to be my the audio is so perfect. desynced on this. What the f***? You want to go to the mainstream? Oh, Wait, Sven! Is on the audio. Is that oh, my guy? Yeah, I think he's dead. Thresh, bro. What are we doing, man? I knew it was bad, bro. Don't pick it. But we'll see oh, if they can come back. Oh, I don't know about that. Okay, wow. never mind. That was a. Was that not just a completely perfect max range Q flash? Yeah, I didn't not think a, it was gonna land it. Not a millisecond too fast. But if it was a millisecond later, then it it would have not knocked him up. Yeah, holy fuck, bro. Like I actually fully believe that if River had played more solo Q, he wouldn't have hit that Q flash because it would have thrown off his timing. Oh, oh, this could be a kill. Oh, he's dead. He's just dead. Great play by Golden Guardians. Actually, great play. Bro, all I'm gonna say is when you have two CLG players on your roster, like, dives are so easy, bro. <laughs> <laughs> they just know! One eye towards one lane, one eye towards another lane, and, like, it's very tense. It's just impossible to break that out of that situation, unless they fuck oh up. Oh my god, that was fucking nasty. Oh. Oh. Oh, he's in. Later, bro. So gone. Oh, nice try, bro. Fuck. <laughs> nah, I mean, this game is just honestly unlucky. Like, you can't let a game like this, like, get you shook. Because everything went wrong early. MNS is playing top lane. Bot lane dies at level one in a, you know, supposedly winning matchup. The Baron throw. The, the Here we problem, go, boy. The problem is that when the enemy team has Maokai, they get way too much information for no risk. So, you're, you're really just okay with a 50-50. Mm. Look at who he spotted. It's very, very smart position by him. Wow. This looks bad for Berserker. He can just die instantly. Oh my god. Wow. Licorice kind of oh. ended. My god. Oh. That was the worst thing is, Jay, I could ever see, bro. <laughs> oh, and we're doing it again. Okay. Maybe it was good. It will be if they can get this going. Wait, I think they got it actually. Yeah. Yeah, never mind. It's it's great engage. Labber too tanky. It's very easy for him to keep everybody else away. Cloud Nine coming in. Oh. Too little, too oh, oh, no, the, the hook, hook misses. Gory's still here in the front line. Tanking up a lot. Golden Guardians will at least lose. Oh, shutdown for Berserker. Okay. Look at Lickers' items, though. Swiftness boots and Morello Nomicon. Like you're fucking joking. Yeah, I don't know what we're building, but... If he had better items, I, I think Zer Berserker might have died last fight. But Morello Nomicon, I think we're roofing, guys. Yeah, it's pretty troll. Usually the supporter jungle the two doggy rolls by items like that. If you're one of the carries, like, you really can't afford to be putting yourself behind so much. That's why I was always, like, trying to tell my team that, like, even though we need healing reduction, the AD carry buying executioners is, like, almost never the right move. That shit is so funny. Dude, like, I remember so many games on stage. Both my carries are like, I'm not buying that shit. Yeah, it's just, yeah, of course. I, I, I think most of the time, both the carries shouldn't buy that shit, and it should be the doggy rolls, top jungle or support. Because <laughs> being 800 gold down on your next item on those rolls barely matters. River's kind of deep. Wait a minute. River's pretty deep. I think he's okay, actually. Wow. Don't worry, we got cannon zero dam on the way. Okay. Yeah, blabber dice. Oh, n and the. It's over. It's over. It's completely yeah. over. They're all gonna die. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait. Aphelios? Oh, he's getting ulted over the wall, bro. He, 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 failed. he failed. He failed his flash. Failed his flash. Wait, these two can die here, actually. If the men is. Never mind. Ooh. Oh my god. Oh my are you god. Are you, are you. Are you. Are you serious? Oh are you serious? Oh. Are you my fucking god. serious? Like, like, unironically, Kennen's item choice is such a big problem for Golden. There's too many times people are living with 1 HP because of his items. Yeah, it's bro. Just, it's crazy if they... Uh, it's 50-50 here, and if they get soul, like, I don't think that C9 can win.
Yeah, I don't think so. River is the god spider, so. Blabber is kind of also a god spider. Oh my god, he stole it! <laughs> Alright, who he died to Ori, Nolte. I think we back off, guys. The fact that C9 was losing early game so bad, they were getting hard stomped early game and and somehow they got the first drag it pays off so much like if they didn't get that first drag and they just played like farm their way back or like played more defensively yeah, over. game would have already been over yeah oh they got it oh my All god right, no flash. Goodbye, guys. oh he's got so many chakras actually oh holy fuck wait no he dies though oh my god they won guys wow this is such a demoralizing loss, bro. Like 7k gold ahead and, and you didn't close out. And you had a pretty strong scaling comp. Yeah. Ken and Zeri, I mean, those are some very high scaling picks. I, I don't think they outscale necessarily, but I think like it's, it's even enough. Bro. Oof. Can't we proto belt to the gate? Okay. Look at Licorice's TP. Uh, and Ori, okay. double TP on the same spots. What is that schedule, bro? What? Wow. Oh, God. Licorice, Whoa. come on, show me something. Oh, we ult the Olaf. It's over. Stick say maybe carries. Stick say carries. No, oh, oh, never mind. He got hooked. Oh, my God. All right, go next. Oh man, I would be so fucking pissed if we lost this game. You can't show that in the you middle. Can't, you can't show it, you can't say anything, but inside I am fucking pissed. Yeah. <laughs> I try to, like, anytime my team is talking about mistakes from the last game that are completely irrelevant for the future, I try to just yeah. shut it down immediately, right? It's completely useless to think about mistakes from the previous game. Yep. Oh my god, Malfire. Isn't this champ just broken? Yeah, I think he's pretty broken. He's he's like banned a lot in LCK. Ever since he got so many buffs. Back to tank versus tank top, I guess. That's so crazy. It's gonna come out. It's gonna go up. That's crazy. They force the flash into the Cloud9 support. Stick saying who he continuing to flex muscles here in the 2v2. Meanwhile, another fight breaks. Oh shit. Oh wow, River's kiting really well. He used the crab to E out. Oh shit. Oh, says dead. Oh wait a minute, wait a minute. Yeah, they lost this. Oh, I love that. Wait. Wait! Golden Guardians wins these! No way! No way! Oh my god! What that? Oh my god. <laughs> Everybody's so low, dude. That was the best fight I've ever seen. It's who he laughing diff. Oh shit, he's laughing. It's an omen. I think if Golden Guardians loses this game, it's quick 3-0. If you can't close out with a, this much of a gold lead two times in a row, then it's fucking over. But they're actually on in good, like on good track, I guess, because they've gotten every drag so far. <sighs> I think Evans has been having a horrible series, like yeah, so far. Yeah. That is his like first time though. Yeah, that's true. Oh shit, I think C9 is just dead here. Yeah, it's weird that they're fighting this six heal down. Maybe they think the items are good enough to take a look. Oh, good engage by Fudge. Oh my god. Maybe not a good engage. Maybe he is a good engage. No, it's not. No, yes, it is. Yes, it is. Wow. All right, Berserker. Let me see something. Berserker's going crazy. Berserker's going crazy. Berserker's going crazy. Uh, Berserker. Oh! Holy shit, Stixay. Good turnaround on Berserker. I was watching Berserker just tickling Malphite for the longest time. Oh, Jesus Christ. Fudge just baiting the shit out of them. Don't yeah, Malphite ulti the solo tank. Yeah, I would never do that. Oh, never want that to happen. That is a rough one. Eminus made a lot of chaos. I just talked shit about him saying he was having a bad series, but him, him kind of going in and just like trading one for one. It just yeah. confused the enemy team a lot, so they weren't hitting the right targets. Oh, okay. 
The Akali looking Wait, for some what is going on? Wait, is he dead? He's, He's dead. Yeah. Flory tries to get away. Blabber's ready to oh, go. No, no, wait. Wait, he kills him anyways? He's so far behind and he still gets it done. Now River wants to mop him. Flash? He might be oh, he doesn't have it, actually. He doesn't have it. Yep. Damn, it just came up, actually. That's a blur. That was a good call out. I, didn't, I, I thought he had it, but it was a sliver off. He's dead. But no, nope, he this just ends up being a fluke. Now they're going to take down. He might one be two them. Oh, oh, he's oh, he's fine. He's but fine. he used the R1 there. He's not going to have ulti oh, yeah. for the drag. That's so That's bad. So then Zeno has to give this, or they fight a 5v5 with no Akali ults. I think they give. Is no one teaching this guy, like, when you split the map for vision control? You know what I'm talking about? Uh, at the timer. You can't walk on side lane at that time. Yeah. No, sure. sure. Like, the guy, they, they always say, like, oh, he plays with no fear, but, like, the way that I see it is, like, he just plays in a way that so easy to punish. They would love to force out his ultimate. They're going to TP in instead. Here comes the Malphite. Golden Guardians are ready to just fight it. They don't want to allow Cloud9 to get oh, oh, dead. Fudge. Is he just dead? Oh wow. my god. He just gets out like that. Eminence. Charm into charm into knock up into charm. Oh, nice play by the Krish. He just ults closest. It's totally worth it. Okay. It might be. Might be over now. Yeah. I think Golden Guardians gets... Oh, okay. Just just Baron. Okay. I thought they might go for like two inhibs or something. Berserk is legit just power farming. Like, he's just trying to get as much gold as possible so he has three items for Elder. I think he probably has it. I think he's going to be completely even with Zaya and items. Yeah. Uh, so, I mean, it's a win con, but like, it's fucking hard to play Zarya against all these champs. Got to dodge Malphite ulti and Wukong ulti and Rickon's bullshit. Yeah, that's the worst. This is scary for Golden Guardians. If, if, if they're up 10k gold, but if if Zeri starts getting going in the fight, she will kill everyone. MNS, bro, what? He is not having a good game. Wow. Hmm. I, I'm like thinking about this, and it's like maybe now you just fight. Ari has no ulti. Your worthless mid laner has no ulti. It's better for you. It's yeah, better for the for the more useless mid laner to trade ultis one for one and just take the fight. Oh, wow! They just one shot closest target like that. Oh, berserker press R or nah? Not yet. Not yet. I mean, oh my god, Wukong. the game's over. Oh! Okay, yeah, game's over. Wait, they can't end anymore. It depends on if 6 can maybe just hit in front of their face. Fudge can't do much. Holy moly, that was oh, so charm. close to killing him. Holy shit. Nice game, I guess. It was a little dicey in the middle, but... Golden Guardians like smashed early and actually closed it. Lucian Nami dies of cringe. Okay, so here's what I think. C9 got stomped early game twice, so now they're overcorrecting and picking the strongest possible early game, and then saying, you know, we're, we're better than them mid and late game anyways, so let's make sure we have a stronger, like, first 10 minutes. Uh, isn't Renekton vs. Kennen a self-counterpick? That's so bizarre. Kennen was a counterpick to Renekton for many years, and also, you could say that C9 has Renekton at least for the top dive, but I feel like Renekton looking completely useless this game. How can yeah, you play Renekton vs. Zeri, Lulu, Kennen, and, and it's not like Lee Sin has to just go in. He can just hold all of his abilities and wait for you to die first. Bet C9 all. Oh, 50-50 for this blue. Blabber got it. Oh. Oh, wait a minute. Sticks A is going crazy mode. Let's go. Sticks A, get him. Sticks A, get him. Wait. Oh, get got. Wait a sec. Okay, my bad. I, I really I really was hyping 6A up there. You know what happened, though? I think he was trying to hide behind his jungler to dodge a cocoon, and fucking, like, River just took one step to the left, 6A took one step to the right, and then all of a like, he just got cocooned randomly. I'm gonna be honest. River would have died as well if he got cocooned. Yeah, probably. You're probably right on that one. It's kind of crazy bad. What? How are you gonna kill him here? Just ain't no way you're gonna kill him. Ain't no way you're killing this. 
but he does blow flash, so it's worth. Huh? Oh, God. we have armor. What? I'm not sure what happened there. The I mean, I'll I'll give C9 some credit here. Like, I think they they're executing well on on their wind gun. Like, they they kind of need to have stuff like this happening. Holy shit! Is he dead? Wow! wow. Spell book ignite, and he didn't calculate it at all. He didn't notice that he swapped summoners. Holy fuck! He just gifted one over, and now there's there's basically no gold lead for uh, for C9. This is exactly kind of how. Oh wait, he can actually oh. die here. Yeah, he could totally die. He. I think Fudge should die for it. Yeah, I think yeah, Fudge should totally die for it. Just get stunned. Yes, good. Um, and now. Wait, what? Where was the cocoon? He got stunned. So like, Fudge got stunned first. Then when his stun faded, he went for the the big stun on Cannon. And then at that exact time, Blabber just got stunned. Oh wow! Golden Gardens is playing so well from behind. Holy shit! He lives though. If River didn't have to blow his kick earlier, that would have been even better. Oh yeah. I mean, the it's fact right. that they are surviving this early game. Oh. Oh. Six eight can't win this. Or, sorry, not Six eight can't win this. Berserker cannot win this. Can he? Holy shit, he gets bubbled? Okay. But now he receives the wild growth to make sure there's no danger. Golden Guardians want to get this shoved up. Wait. Wow, that was a perfect cocoon. Completely perfect cocoon. Oh my god. He saw it flash. I think he could have got out. This is what I don't get, bro. Look at top. He picked Renekton into Kennen. My experience has always been that top laners are crying so hard I can't pick Renekton if he plays Kennen. Doesn't Renekton have no TP? Can't we just TP bottom on these guys? Oh. Dude, Lucian just flashed in on bottom, bro. Crazy shit's happening. Bottom. When there are no tanks in the oh, he didn't flash. He just dashed on his ass. Look at this. Oh my god. Okay. Guys, don't we have TP? We have TP. Oh, no. We have TP behind with Licorice in like five seconds. They're pinging the ward even. Oh, they're they're danger pinging. I, I think I think C9 is actually thinking about it, which is really impressive if they're going to respect yeah. the TP play. What does Lucian build with Straight of Dirk? He just sits on it and eventually he sells it. It's kind of the way I the way I like to tell my teammates is it's kind of my version my boots since I have free boots and I never upgraded until like super late game. So yeah. it just puts me 1100 gold into the hole, but. And we'll see if they want to fight for you it. kind of make the money back on first strike like it doesn't obviously you're not going to make all 1100 gold back just because of first strike but rather than buying mythic item plus boots you just buy mythic item and dirk mm. that's actually a play that a lot of people oh my god that's a lethal damage holy shit i mean there you go that's why you buy serrated dirk Right on your screen, and Licker is trying to escape from Fudge, but the Prowler's Claw follows. Prowler's Claw to keep him on top. C9 early game, baby. I know, they're crazy. Wait, we're going Void Staff second? Okay, man. Uh, did Licker just sell his thing? I'm pretty sure he did. Did he? Yeah. Oh my god. Crazy flank. Crazy flank! No, nothing comes of it, though. Wow. They don't... Oh, Kenny wasn't even there, actually. Was he there? Watching the game between the Ari with multiple ult charges and the Prowl. Wow, Evanes actually goes for that and it's just completely blind. He had no vision of anyone, like he had no idea who was in that bush. Not a clue. And he just randomly kills River. Oh, he finished Shadow is, is this a solo kill or is this, a, is this Fudge just going to kill him here? Is Fudge just going to kill him there? I, I feel like he might. I think, yeah, he's dying right now, but we're not looking, guys. Like, uh, Licorice is losing his mind. Like, he's completely losing his mind he's like chasing wow. he's chasing fudge down lane and like giving him range to go on him when he's not winning one v one oh wow huh we're, we're, we're using cannon ulti on elise when she's in spider form 
keeps the gravy train oh wow guys who he's dead everyone's oh, just dying right now fudge is just running it in let's get it bro i think someone commented on his build and he's like yeah fuck this shit yeah oh yeah you think my build is shit <laughs> i'll show you watch this bro you think shadow flame was a good play all right I'll build Shadow Flame this game. We'll see how good it is. No, I mean it's just two cannon games in a row where he's not really performing. It's he's he's playing really well on other picks like Fiora, Gwen, Malphite even. Uh, oh my god. god, bro! Better Koreans win, I guess. I, I'm like so happy to be wrong. Like I think C9 made the totally right call where it's not an overcorrection. Like they just know. We we specialize in playing early game. We are we're not picking right to our team strengths, so let's fix it and and just like make sure we have a winning early game. And like they they're actually so clean with it. Yeah, exactly. Oh my, dude, the box did so much damage. Level 16 solos. Goodbye, boys. Yeah. Yeah, they're kind of right. completely roasted. Oh wait a minute, we're throwing. But uh, maybe. Nah, this should be GG. Yeah, Berserker is kind of huge. I blinked. I when did they get Mountain Soul? I totally wasn't paying attention. Uh, just before they killed Cannon. Okay. On the one trap. I think now it's time for Golden Guardians to make a small correction. Like, they picked Zeri twice, they lost twice with it. They won against Zeri themselves by playing, um, what do they play, Zyra Khan? I, I, Zeri might might be, you know, strong champ, but like, for some reason in LCS playoffs, she's just not looking good, so. This series is not it, boys. Yeah. Let's drop the pick and focus on having, like, one or two winning lanes you can play to. And let's drop the cannon as well. That's not working. All right, BGS, no more Zeri, thank God. The Lucian Nami versus. Wait. Uh, Zeri just goes through. Both teams realize it's trap pick. Yeah. I've always wanted to try Poppy Joel versus Lucian. It never really lined up on our team, but I feel like it could be really good. Let's say Lucian has no flash. You can just flash E on him just so you can do like a one second ulti and Lucian will just die because he can't press any dashes. Wow, Golden Guardians with the full big dick comp. Like, they just want to go in. I feel like C9's is a little more balanced, and Olaf could just run this game over, man. Yeah. Yeah. That's a crazy pick for us, their champs. He's going to be drain tanking three melees. Have you ever seen a ghost malphite in your life? <laughs> no, man. No, no. I've never seen that. He's going to ult in later and die, bro. Yeah. Don't you? When you're losing this matchup, you don't. You level up a skill, right, right until you need it. You yeah. Gory gets locked down. Wait, is it a solo kill? One more auto attack. They do it. First oh no. This is of this Malphite, a stack wave early And on. okay, just flash, just well. flash the stun here. Okay, no fucking way, Lickers, bro. Hello? That was pretty interesting. And look at the We're just gonna stand there and get stunned? Well, yeah, I mean, you don't wanna make it too hard to get dove. You just kinda wanna stand there and right next to the tower. Why didn't he just ghost out of there? Holy fuck, is C9 hosting a watch party in their coach room? <laughs> like, <laughs> I love Jack's face right there. Oh my god. He shoves stick safe. He's dead. The blade caller gets him rooted. He is. Oh wow. Wow, that was so well played. Like his The laver is coming up huge. He does exactly. Oh. Oh. That was literally the best thing that could happen for Stix A is that he dies, he gets gold slash XP on that assist. And got a new quiver. Yeah, he got a decent buy off of it and it's like not that bad. Actually, now Berserker needs to base and gets canceled by Huhi. Uh, Huhi's gonna get canceled. Huhi's gonna cancel him. Like, he's always doing this shit. Okay. All right, guys. Uh, okay. Yeah, I mean, like, okay. Uh, Thanks everybody for watching. We'll see you guys. <laughs> yeah. Uh, he did cancel him. I I mean, oh my usually you want to cancel him max range, not like like that. His Yone, LeBlanc, Silas look ten times better than his other jumps.
who he has rotated up into the yeah. oh my god with the flash into chain, look at this guy who he oh okay wait Blabber what Blabber? Is, are... in thing. Blabber is completely in thing oh no uh... oh no that was that was pretty rough to watch he's rubbing his eye bro he's falling asleep a chance at herald i mean honestly when you die early game you're so fast out on the map like if, if he gets yeah if fudge can just make some time here Flabber will be back faster than enemy team can react nice okay now Sven and m &S are trying to put Wow, Malphite just ults. Fudge gets thrown up into the air by Lick. Dude. Like that? Okay. Just trying to keep him away from Fudge. This guy thought he was AP or what? All over these small skirmishes here I think he's batting side. DPM a bit. Is still hanging around trying to clear out some of these wards. Won't get the last hit on that one. m and Sven. Uh, Ghost Malphite here, boys. Ghost out of there, buddy. I think he can escape. Oh, we flashed in to save our Malphite? Uh, dude, there have been way too many bad sequences that start with Licorice doing something really dumb. Like, last game on Ken- Th Dude, he has his moves again! He has his moves again! I'm gonna cry! Usually- Meanwhile, Fudge on the Olaf has had- Does this guy not have ghosts? Popping his ultimate whenever he wants versus Licorice. It He's time. completely chilling. Ult him, ult him. Licorice died without using ulti? This is not normally. Oh my Stay god. Really close to bursting. Stick what the fuck? There. I guess but that's why he rushed Shadow Flame. <laughs> this actually really reminds me of like right, when... Right now did, did you watch the playoffs where Luger went Ghost Cleanse on Zeri? Yep. It's like... These champs are so crazy synergistic with Flash. And like, what I like to think about, like those kind of players is they're super five head. So like they, they they always try not to think about the game like like a sheep, but like to the extreme. Hold on, hold on, wait, Blaver, not the best engage and oh, actually, oh, it doesn't look that bad, doesn't look that. Oh shit, six A, six A lost his mind. We look so nothing. This is Zaya's. I, I I try to get my team to play around Baron when I have two items because Zaya's the probably the fastest Baron. So, carry right now at two items wow. yeah exactly at two items she just does it so fast Five thousand health and dropping but golden guardians are here okay it's a 50 50 but drummer's uh, gone yeah poppy's so good at these situations i, I talk about this so much it's like almost pointless to say it again but why is the game so hard to end on the enemy team gets barren they're 9k gold ahead they have great split pushing champs olaf and leblanc why does it always feel so hard to end the game the compared to before Guardians there's like something wrong and i, I don't know like what it is it's like maybe the waves need to be synced like maybe they should have baron increase the movement speed of the of the wave so that you can like manipulate the waves to crash at the same time like i, I don't know what it is but it's crazy to me that a single inhib doesn't get cracked off first baron when it's like that snowballed I just think he's ex not experienced. It is, nobody's confident to take the fights, bro. Yeah, I mean, I, push the wave and then we gotta, we gotta chuck somebody out mm. right away on the tower. Or like what we used to do, where it's like we're gonna approach the tower and then you have everybody just set position so that we can get chip damage in, you know? Mm -hmm. And then if they go on you, you just flash and then they die. Okay. Can they catch Fudge? Yes. Ghosts. Fudge here. Fudge oh. He still has the Ragnarok. He hasn't even used it. Oh. There. He finally claims it. Throws the Undertow back. Oh. The isn't there wow. The he lives that. And Licorice just ults the Blanc. Uh, Feels bad, bro. man. That was their Hail Mary. Like, they had to make something good happen there. Well, hopefully they hold out and get the Elder and then win the game. You're a Golden Guardians fan? I wanted to go to five games, but it's Holy over. Holy shit. He's just melted. Alright, boys. Our team comp is ass. Yeah. Actually, it's Coach Gap. Who drafted this? Oh my god. Oh. 
what is what is Berserker doing? He's like, everybody wait, everybody wait. Well, I'm happy for MNS. Means a lot to him, and he's playing really good. Dude, he barely subbed in, too. Like, holy fuck. Yeah, just randomly halfway through. Foggy. What the hell? The guy looks like Chowster. I was like, what the fuck? That's racist, Jack. <laughs> he does kind of look like Chowster a bit. <laughs> yeah, I was like, wait a minute. Uh, All right, bro. That's enough for me. I'm out. Thanks to the yeah, yeah, hangout yeah. The party. See you next, uh, what? MSI? Well, yeah. <laughs> Absolutely. All right, bro. Yeah, later. we'll watch you guys later.